freaking big. Okay. Hello. Look at that. Look at that hat. Damn. Now I feel like I gotta go get my other hat to justify why I had to buy two hats. Also, uh, Mia technically bought it, and she gets 40% off because she's got the good, good connections. <laughs> A whoop, jump, bar tray. <laughs> Yo, Budspot is just hours and hours of entertainment. Budspot is basically, like, chat AI, but just butts. Just butts. Oops, all butts. All right, we're on games and demos now. <laughs> Alrighty, uh, options. I hide skybox with fog. Nah, nah. That's all the options. I like options. This man looks happy. That's why they call him the smiling man. He's so silly. <laughs> <laughs> Look at that man. He's so silly. He's just over there smiling. I love it. That's so good. Dun dun dun. Noxus. All right, I'm enjoying this a lot so far. I'm gonna get close to the microphone. It's the smiling man. Yo, look at that booty though. That Charmander booty. I have a habit of leaving everything for the night. I do that. Yeah, many say that this hobby of mine is strange. And then I decided to go shopping at the market for dinner at dawn. But tonight, I came face to face with evil. It was a horrible and scary experience. It was 2 a.m. Ooh, all right. I'm intrigued. Okay. Yo, we are quick. It might be 2 a.m., but damn. He watches you all the time, even at bedtime, all the time. <laughs> well, okay. Is he watching me now? But it's not bedtime. It's going to the store time. Why am I leaving my house at this hour? Dear God, the main character, he's British. <laughs> I'm too tired to run now. Alrighty. I guess we're not going to go for a 2 a.m. run. Can I go talk to my neighbors? Hello. I'm going to the market, I guess. You mind? With the... The flickering... Light? Yo, we're having a party. It's, 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 it's the slowest rave ever. Oh. Yo, there he is! Big PP! Big P, um, let me think. Let me think what, what I want to compliment you on, Big P. There's just so many things. Um, Big P, I actually missed you earlier in chat because we were talking about your favorite bird. And I was like, man, Big P has so much love in their heart for this bird. And that's re really, really, truly special. It's a bird only a Big P can love. Gold. What is up with this haunted grass? Well, it is 2 a.m. We're going to the market. Why? Why would we go this way? It's so dark. Hello? Oh my god, he is British! Why are you trying to break into people's homes? Because it's 2 a.m. and I'm bored. Isn't that what you do when it's 2 a.m. and you're bored? All right, let's hope the market's open. I mean, there's a car in the driveway. Hello? No, okay. Click E to interact. Yo! Yeah! That's my favorite guy. <laughs> Those jeans, though. Damn! What are those? He's got the bread loaves. Hell yeah. I love it. Alright, what do I want? Um, this looks like spicy ramen. I'll take that. Oh yeah, they got the one-sided shelves. 
<laughs> no, we're in England. Ah! <laughs> the scariest part about the game. It was one dollar eighty-one cents. There you go. That's good price for ramen. Hello? He's very tall. Okay. I mean, I suppose that's fine. He seems harmless. I know we classified him as evil before, but... Oh no! A British man! <laughs> He's gonna smile at me. I'm worried that I'm going to, like, run right into him here, though. Oh, look. Another man. That's not where the bus stop is. You're going to miss the bus. All right. Is this my home? Is this my home? Is this my home? Is this my home? Which one's my home? Is this my home? Is this my home? I'm lost. Oh no. I'm lost again. Happens all the time. That one star was really bright. This is Cody phone home. Hello? Is he just going to stand there menacingly? He's doing the little kitty dance in the corner. The next night. Why do I live? <laughs> I'll do you one better. It's the same. The next night. Did you is that a new is that a new shirt? Did you get a new shirt? I like it. Maybe he's just a fellow night owl. He's just being super rude about it. <laughs> is he doing a dance? What is he doing? What do you mean, skip? Why would I skip this? He's doing the, the dance of his people. The smiling people. Oh, he's doing the cat part of the dance. We saw that one earlier. I love it. I love it. What the hell do you want? Yeah. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Wait, no, come back. Teach me the dance. Lol. That's a good one. Uh-oh. Why am I looking down? See, the scary thing would be is I would then go look in the mirror. Wait, why can I? I can move on the road now. Yeah, yeah. It's me and I's anniversary tomorrow. We got married a year ago. Isn't that crazy? I guess I'm running? I guess I'm running. I guess I'm running. What are the odds I turn around? Early grass, you guys. Aw, oh, thanks. You guys are sweet. Uh oh. Damn. Uh oh. I didn't see nothing. <laughs> L. That sounds pretty good. Bad ending. Oh man, you're telling me that there's a good ending? Because now I'm gonna have to play it again. Damn it. I like the guitar at the end though. Was I supposed to fight him? 
Because I don't really want to play all of that again right now. It was... It's too long to just go immediately back through. Maybe we'll revisit. We can revisit for sure. And this is going to load me at the last night again. My guy walks like a Scooby-Doo character. <laughs> well, nobody can see you when you walk like that, clearly. All right, yeah, we'll, we we might revisit it. We might revisit it. Um, I think you guys also voted for. Was it feet in the snow or nocturnal visit that you guys voted for? I don't remember. Who remembers? Who remembers? Nocturnal. Okay. Um. Yeah. All right, it's booting up. Oh, here we go. Nice. Nocturnal visit. Am I ready to leave? When the crosshair turns red, you can interact by pressing E. Very nice. I have to clean my room. No! It's almost like a modified point-and-click game, and I like it. Right, let's go make sure that we're good to go. Here, look, Phasma vibes. I do love Phasma. It's a good game. Do I get scared easily? I do, actually. I'm pretty much a big weenie, but I also like getting scared. I don't know. There's a weird balance. And also, certain things scare me more than others. Like, honestly, Winnie the Pooh might arguably be one of the... I just checked the laptop. One of the scariest things. Viral horror. Urban exploration. Spookiest haunted house. This is no normal house. Its backstory even helps to add to the spookiness. Built in the 60s, this house was home for several serial killers. Nowadays, all it's left is the remains of the lives that were taken in this place. But why is it still a mystery? Numerous reports of disappearances have been made after some people had visited this house. We do not recommend to explore this house by any means. It's not safe and you might not return from it. Nice. I love it. Where's my history? If I might not return, I better clear my browser history. You know what I mean? Um, I can't shut that door. Spooky's Jump Scare Mansion. It's pretty long, but it's good. You did tell me that before, Big P. We should totally do that. We should totally do that. F for flashlight. Classic. I love it. I love it. I wonder if we're going to find any more smiling men. Hello? Is this telling me that I'm going the wrong way? Okay. I'm going the wrong way. Whoops. My mistake. We'll open the creepiest gate ever. A creepy gate. And then we're going to go in the house. Let me know if it's too quiet for you guys. I might actually turn it up a little bit. That way you guys get spooked too. That way, it's not just me. Well, this is definitely the house from the picture. I'm going to go check the back door. Mmm, crunchy. Somebody's over there eating a bag of potato chips. Although it's 2023, they could be whatever kind of chips you want. It could be taro root treat chips, which are really good. If you guys haven't had taro, treat, taro root chips, they're fantastic. Oh. Veggie straws used to be all the rage, but now even they're boring. You know what I mean? Heads to the basement. All right. I know. I'm glad how I how I just know that intuitively. So smart. Who smashed this mirror? Not me. Now let me just pee myself real quick so I don't do it when the ghost shows up. Hopefully it's a ghost. 
And if it's not, then it doesn't seem edible. But if it's not a ghost, then the threat is much more real. Some leftovers. Yo, it's pizza. I love pizza. So my work currently deals with restaurants and there's like literally a pizza exhibition going on. And yo, those are the salt and vinegar ones. A pizza exhibition going on in Las Vegas over like March, late March. And I really want to go because I love pizza. Am I investigating this house or... Oh, wow. That chicken pot by or is that ham? It could go either way. I'm not sure. I'm not sure. I suppose we'll check upstairs. To the garage. All right. I'm not sure if those were my footsteps or somebody banging on a door. I am not sure. May as well check out the attic real quick. Mr. Teddy, no! I got a garage key. How is that turning on? Wow. Old technology, man. They really don't make them like they used to. I'm not scared. Should I go straight to the garage or continue exploring upstairs? I'm going to continue exploring upstairs. Hey! Don't be throwing those. Those are expensive. Okay, this game is doing a good job of leaving the unknown all unknown. Alright, we got the disconnected tone. Very nice. Was there a little bit of the Doppler effect there? Kind of like it. Uh oh, the raccoon got in the garage again. Who's in here? We got a basement key. I must be really large if I'm like this much taller than a car. I'm basically Mr. Incredible. Hello? I didn't see nothing. I promise. It's fine. I'm sure they didn't go down into the basement. I'm sure they were leaving the basement. Yo! I love the horsey. Update 1. 1.43 a.m. The house just seems abandoned overall. Nothing's happened. Update 2, 1.51 a.m. About 10 minutes in, and I'm starting to feel a bit overwhelmed. I really don't like this environment in this place. I've heard several weird noises, and I feel like I'm being watched. Update 3, 2.02 a.m. Getting in this place was a complete mistake. Something is definitely stalking me, but I can't see it. Update 4, 2.05 a.m. The door is locked, and I got no way of getting out. I'm screwed. Update 5. Something is coming to the basement. Dun, dun, dun. This is just a normal house in Ohio. <laughs> Damn. Good thing I don't live in Ohio. Instead, I only have Florida man. I'm getting a phone call. Hold on. One minute. Do I not have a voice, a voice machine? Voicemail? Don't be so sad. I answered the phone. I tried calling you earlier, but it was disconnected. All the music is gone. Did the back door just open? Alrighty. I'll bite. I'll go see what you have to offer, Mr. Backdoor. You got something for me, me, after I spill my milk. <laughs> oh, come on. 
Don't let that be the end. Dang. Oh man, it did so well. It did so well. The ending should have been a chase sequence. It should have been something. But that was pretty good. That was pretty good. I enjoyed that. That was pretty good.